What is up, YouTube? It's your boy, Whoa, Dawg. So, look my back here again with another vid for the crib. Hey, if you guys are new, channel, leave a like, down, comment, tell me what you guys think, etc., etc. As this crazy Saturday win for us, man, uh, it's not that impressive for me. Uh, we went 28 to 24. Honestly, this game came down to our defense getting a clutch fumble, uh, scoop and score. Uh, Melvin Ingram calls that fumble on his former teammate, Melvin Gordon. Uh, that was clutch. That was a clutch play, uh, and Nick Bowden picked it up and he and he took it all the way. And Drew Locke, uh, former Kansas City native, cannot make the tackle on his former teammate Nick Bowden because you know that Bowden with the MU. Uh, Nick Bowden took it all the way to the crib for 86 yards, and that was that. So basically, man, this game came. I mean, we started off strong. You know, we came, dude. We got a got a clutch TD pass for uh to Travis Kelsey. Uh, we started off strong, but then we started to slowly, you know, slow down on our offense. Because the momentum started to started to go to the other side, the Broncos. Um, Broncos had a slow start, you know. Uh, gave them a boost because you know Dan Swanson. I think I think it was Dan Swanson. He had hit the kicker and they ended up getting the first down and they go back and they go down there and they score. Um, Drew Lock. I mean, he was. I mean, honestly, you know, Drew Lock really made this the game. Him and his scrambling mobility. Um, for him to do that, man, you know, uh, it put the Kansas City Chiefs. I'll notice a little bit because we're not used to seeing Drew Locke do that, but he did that, uh, and he was everywhere. You know, and Melvin Gordon, too, you know, he came out and he ran, they ran a the ball over us, you know. And Tim Patrick, he had a game on us, too, so I got to give props to the Broncos. They came out and they played their heart out on, that, on, on the final game, you know, as expected. And every rival game, you know, is not always going to be like a, like a blowout. Honestly, it wouldn't be my expectations. I thought that we were going to blow them out, but that did not happen. So, uh, well, I mean, the Kansas City Chiefs, I'm not impressed because, like, I felt like that this game shouldn't have been a game, honestly. You, you know, uh, I felt like that, you know, we, we should have, I mean, I mean, we should have we should have got up by at least a couple scores. But, you know, it is what it is. You know, I'll take this win, you know, and we just got to move on. You know, uh, as far as playoff-wise, it's not looking that great because, you know, the way we perform today, if we perform like that in playoffs, let's be real. We're not winning the game like that. You no, know, our defense, it's like I got mixed emotions for our defense because I feel like our defense really wasn't playing that great, you know. But that play made up for everything, so that's why I'm, I'm really like, ah, yeah. So it is what it is. So, um, yeah, but uh, our defense, man, I mean, um, we just got to we just gotta lock down, man. You know, uh, our linebackers, it seemed like at sometimes that we didn't know what we was doing because, it, like, I don't know what it is. I don't know what was going on. But Drew Locke was making some audible calls and the flat routes, you know, the running backs that run out to the flats and they were getting wide open. I mean, I mean, it was all day for them. So, um, and, and, you know, Tim Patrick, I don't know what was going on with him. He was just open all night. So, us with that, I mean, we got to lock down on that and we just got to make sure that, you know, don't make too many mistakes. Offensive-wise, you know, uh, crazy uh, to see Tyree Kill go out so early and uh, Travis Kelsey, like he was limping at the end of that play. Hopefully he's good. Um, Hopefully them guys are ready to go. Daryl Williams, he got hurt too as well. So, I mean, we need them guys. You know, them guys is, is the spark of our offense. But great, great, great performance today from McCole Harmon. He stepped up. You know, I've been waiting for this for, my, for a minute. But McCole Harmon stepped up today. He definitely took on the role of Tyree Kill. Uh, and, and McKinney. You know, McKinney did too, man. You know what I'm saying? Um, not, not a guy that has really been, you know, talked about as much. Came through, stepped up, and he played his part. And he, he is another reason why we won this game today. Uh, so, great, so, great game for McKinney. Um, defense, like I said, defense, that clutch fumble, you know, uh, that, that definitely is the reason why we won. Um, cause you know, if without that fumble, I'm going, I'm going to go ahead and say it, they go down and different Broncos, they go down there and score because I mean, I mean, the way Melvin Gordon was running the ball on us, I mean, it was, it seemed like he was unstoppable. So, um, I don't know, man. So, uh, I don't know, but like, but it didn't happen. We came through defense, stepped up and we did what we had to do and we won the game. Yeah. So, um, yeah, this is like our 12th win over the different Broncos or 11th. I know it, it's it's hard. It's really hard. You know what I'm saying? It, it's hard, you know, uh, being a – I mean, especially from the Broncos, they wanted to win this game so bad. So you can't blame them. They came out, they played their heart out, and, and that's that, you know. So defense, we got, we got to lock it up. Uh, so tomorrow we, I will be on – everybody be on to watch for tomorrow because tomorrow we got to hope and pray that the Houston Texans beat the Titans tomorrow. Uh, I hope they do so, so we can tame the number one seed. If not – we will be playing. So um, hopefully, and we'll be playing, and our guys, and our guys got to get ready. So that's that, man. Uh, great game today. Overall, perform I mean, well, great game for the Broncos today. You know, Chiefs, well, we had a decent game. Uh, defense stepped up. They played their part. It is what it is. We won. So that's all that matters. So um, 
tomorrow's all in the all in the Texans' hands tomorrow. So Texans, if you guys can do us a solid, I appreciate it. But anyway, man, it's your boy. Well, I took the match of peace. They like to ever come out to what you guys think, and that's that. Hey, last game of the season, and let's hope that we make this push and we go back to the bowl, man. That's all. Of, hey, that's all. That's that's all of my consciousness right now. Super Bowl. That's it. Anyway, I'm out. peace.